Hello, this is Lolly. Um, a while ago, well, just within the last couple of weeks, I showed you that when I went to uh, Doodlebug Let's Get Creative, I had made this as a, it was a class we did. Now I had taken some photos with my Instax Mini 8 camera, and as you can see, the photos on there, it's got the white Polaroid frame around it, but the photo itself is about one and three quarters by two and a by, nope, less than that, by a little less than two and a half, like two and a quarter. Uh, although the actual paper itself is a bigger size than that. And so this is what I had. And so with an Instax mini camera, you're taking a picture and it puts it out just like a Polaroid and it develops while you're watching. But my friend Julie had this camera, which is the HP Sprocket, which will print any photo from your um, phone. So, um, so the problem with this is like, I can't duplicate this exact photo now because it was just a camera that made the photo. Whereas this, I can print as many of these if I had a sprocket as I want. And this makes a two by three inch photo. So the actual photo size is bigger than these. And these come out pretty dark, I've noticed, you know, even though the flash um, does work on it. So I went ahead and took the plunge and I ordered a sprocket off of Amazon. I'll give you the link. This one is a blue one and I'll show you how it came. It came with the cord and just this tray. All this, this is, this is just warranty information. There's nothing else on there. Nothing. In, this is it. This is it. This is all the instruction you get. I was kind of disappointed about that. Um, but I also ordered this case. This case was separate, but there is the sprocket there. And again, it comes with this cord, which is a USB charging uh, cord. And it takes about 90 minutes to get a full charge when it's uh, completely dead. So um, I had to go online. I see this here. It says to open it, you slide this back and lift it up. And then it comes with one pack of 10 photos. All these are in 10 photo uh, segments. I'll show you because I ordered. These are extra. Um, and this is called Zinc uh, Technology. And it's an inkless printing because um, what they do is there's some sort of um, crystals. It says online, the printing technology, it puts crystals on each sheet of paper that shows up as specific colors when heated. So this is basically just heating the photo so the colors come out. And um, so, yeah, no ink. And this is what the paper looks like. And you'll notice that uh, you'll see the blue here. So it's 10 sheets of photo paper with one sheet of this blue paper with the um, barcodes on it. So you just lay it down in there with the blue side down, blue barred code down, and then close it. And the very first time you use that particular packet, it read the first thing it does is read the blue barred code and spit it out. I got rid of it, I shouldn't have. I should have kept the first one to show you. Um, but then it will produce your photo. So now you control the whole thing through your um, app on your phone by Bluetooth. So I'm gonna turn that on, where's the light? Oops, there it is. There's the light right there. And it does change colors when you're charging. So let me open this. Get some brightness going in here. So hopefully you can see it. And then I have my, oops, wrong, wrong. Get my app. So I have the app, which is just called the Sprocket app. And first, oops, first I need to do is get the Bluetooth going. So let's turn that Bluetooth on. Okay, so here it is, the HP Sprocket. I've already paired it before, and it get, you know, I went online to look on how to um, connect on the Bluetooth here. So it's connecting, and it will let me know when it's done. So once it's connected, I can choose a photo. Um, the app will automatically choose one. I mean, let me choose photos. I can edit them. I can make them. I can zoom in. Of course, that will make it grainy. I can add words. Um, Okay, it finally connected. I don't know what took so long, but I do have the app. Apparently you have to have the app on, which I did. Um, so all I need to do is select a photo. I'm going to go to all here. Now let's just go to camera. I don't need da -da -da, back up camera. Okay, let's just take a picture of... Let me do this one here. Okay. So this is, it shows you can edit these, but see this one here shows the printer connecting to Sprocket printer. 
and sending to printer. And this is a picture that I took, um, I had taken while we were at this uh, Doodlebug event. I hear it. Slight humming sound. These are about $120. I chose the blue because for some reason it was it was 100 and the others were 120. Sometimes if it's a specialty color it'll be a little more pricey. And it's coming out. It's really fast. I'm I'm impressed at how quick this is. The beauty of this and there's the photo. slightly more yellow than this one is, but still, I think it's an excellent, excellent job. The beauty of this is being at a crop or somewhere where you just need a photo printed right then, and I just think this is a fabulous, fabulous tool. I'm going to be really excited about playing with this, and um, I'm just looking forward to it. This here looks like where you actually take a photo because you can print a, by doing a photo right there instead of using something that's already in here. So. You know, on the spur of the moment, you can just use the camera then, use the app, take a photo, print it out. So I think it's a wonderful tool. Looking forward to using it more. And um, it took me a long time to settle on a case. I really think this one here is so adorable. And I think it's a great, great product. Looking forward to using it more. Thank you for watching.